Holograph is one of the printing techniques used to create hand pulled prints. This video shows the making of one type of Holograph plate which will be used in a multi plate print. The print will consist of two Holograph plates and one etched zinc plate. Starting with a zinc plate, two mat boards were cut to exactly the same size. This piece of mat board was then coated on both sides with several layers of thinned polymer medium. From there, the image etched onto the zinc plate was transferred to the Holograph plate, which you can view in one of my previous videos posted to this channel. The polymer medium leaves a smooth surface on the mat board, and after several coats, it will be smooth enough to wipe clean and free of ink at print time. Here shows peeling away that smooth top surface of the mat board to expose the rough cardboard surface underneath. Base polymer medium is useful for creating glazes, extending colors of acrylic paints, and enhances gloss and translucency. It has an oil-like feel and is resinous in nature. Besides being used mixed or applied to paints, polymer medium is an excellent sealant. In this case, it seals the mat board plate from any liquids such as solvents and inks. It also toughens the plate, lengthening its print life. Once the top layer is peeled away, another thin coat of polymer medium is applied to the plate to seal it once again, and then once dry, the image is traced. This allows for the image to be seen more clearly through masking tape. The plate is then masked and trimmed to allow work to be done on the background, leaving the rest of the plate untouched. Modeling paste that has been tinted yellow is applied to the plate. This will result in textured ink in those areas left on the print when it's run through the press. The plan is to print this plate a shade of green. I'm sometimes asked how many hours it takes to create one of my prints, including printing the edition. Time-lapse videos can be very deceiving, but it can actually take up to several hundred hours depending on the size and complexity of the piece. It also depends on the number of prints in the edition. Once I've completed this print, I'll estimate the time it took and include it in my next video. and here shows the plate ready to be inked and printed. Watch for a future video showing the multi-plate print pulled through the press. That's always exciting.